now honoring a football legend. Flags are flying half staff across the Sunshine State in honor of Bobby Bowden. He died last weekend, as we know, after a bout with pancreatic cancer. The beloved, and I mean beloved, former FSU head coach will lie in repose at the Florida Capitol Rotunda this morning before his funeral, which is tomorrow. News for Jack's reporter Jamal St. Cyr is live for us in Tallahassee. Jamal, there are more events happening today to celebrate his life and his ongoing legacy. That's right. You know, you didn't have to be a sports fan or even a Seminoles fan to understand greatness. And Bobby Bowden really embodied that word on and off the football field. Very illustrious football career. He had 377 wins on the college football field, along with two national championships to go with a dozen ACC championships. And, you know, Jacksonville played even a little bit of a part in those ACC championships as Jacksonville hosted the first ever ACC championship game. And, of course, Bobby Bowden able to lead Florida State to a win in that game. Coach Bowden said he always loved his time he was able to spend on the first coast near Jacksonville. One of my favorite parts of the country, you know, I used to come here and go out to the fort just to see the fort. You know, I love military and uh, spent a lot of time in Jacksonville. I always thought if I was going to live in a big city, that might be where I'd want to live, you know, but I'm happy in Tallahassee. And flags are at half staff across the state in honor of Coach Bowden. Now, Coach Bowden will be here at the Florida State Capitol building. Doors are scheduled to open in a little bit under an hour as he arrives here. And fans will be able to go inside and view and say their final goodbyes to Coach Bowden before he heads to Florida State later on in the day. Here in Tallahassee, I'm Jamal Saints here for Channel 4, the local station. The morning show will continue right after the break.